Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Stan here with you. Hope you're all doing great today. I'll be talking about my new action cam that is the SJ8 Pro. I'll be doing a video quality comparison between the SJ8 Pro and the SJ7 Star at 1080p 60fps resolution uh, mainly because this is what most uh, youtubers commonly use i'll also be doing a video quality comparison between the different firmware versions that is the official firmware version 1.3 versus version 1.3.1 there's also a new hacked uh, firmware version mod 4.2 uh, from russia from uh, kaliningrad so i'll be doing a video quality comparison between all these video footages most of you sj8 pro owners know that uh, in 4K this uh, cam is actually absolutely uh, flawless, it's too good, the video quality is uh, very nice but uh, it's at 1080p 60fps where this cam actually falls short it's mainly because SJ cam haven't actually put in their resources to improve the video quality at 1080p because their focus was just on 4K uh, as a result if you've seen a uh, few months back the, especially the comparisons between uh, SJ7 and SJ8 I really didn't find uh, much difference in the video quality or the, the dynamic range between the SJ7 and the SJ8 cam clarity at 1080p 60fps and this was mainly due to one reason the bitrate, the low bitrate in 1080p the actual bitrate in 1080p in the earlier firmware versions was just uh, a pathetic uh, 12 MB per second and uh, this has uh, further improved slightly I think in version 1.3 firmware the bitrate had increased to 18 MB per second that is also not outstanding and in the most recent uh, firmware version update version 1.3.1 uh, the bitrate has actually increased uh, to a respectable 30 MB per second and uh, to be honest I was not impressed even with that although the video quality was much better than the SJ7 at 60 FPS 1080p I still wasn't impressed I wanted something more uh, because especially when you consider the hardware uh, spec sheet of this uh, SJ8 Pro um, it actually can do much better than just 30 MB per second at uh, 1080p and uh, this is where I found a hacker called Kaliningrad from Russia he actually has a modded firmware, the mod uh, 4.2 firmware that actually increases the 1080p 60fps bitrate from uh, 18 MP per second to a whopping 60 MP per second and, and the video quality has massively improved on the SJ8 Pro so this is my SJ7 star uh, cam, the previous one that I had the SJ7 is actually on its uh, latest firmware version that is version 1.22 and this is on its modded firmware that is mod 4.2 so I'll be doing a comparison, show you how massive the difference is between the SJ7's video quality and also the SJ8 Pro's video quality. And uh, after that, I'll also show you a comparison between the official firmware's version 1.3 and the 1.3.1 versus the mod 4.2 version firmware. So without further ado, let's get to it. both the cams were shot at the same time uh, you can't see much differences from far away shots but you can clearly see the sky how blue it is compared to the SJ8 the SJ7's dynamic range is not that good the contrast is also much better in the SJ8 as you can see from these shots you can see the leaves and the branches much more better on the SJ8 Pro Just check out the leaves now. This is where the difference is more pronounced. Just see how vivid the colors are on the SJ8 Pro Mod 4.2. And look at the branches also. In comparison, the SJ7 seems more washed out. Now both these shots were uh, shot at different uh, times. Uh, the SJ8 Pro Mod 4.2 was shot when it was a bit overcast whereas uh, the version 1.3 was shot when it was more brighter so it might not be a fair comparison but still you can see uh, a lot of differences once you go further ahead in the video obviously the dynamic range is again better in Mod 4.2 compared to the version 1.3 just check out the leaves the details are much uh, finer and better in Mod 4.2 just check out these leaves and branches right now the difference is more pronounced mod 4.2 is definitely much better than version 1.3 details the contrast are also way much better than version 1.3 I'm actually very impressed with version 1.3.1 
the dynamic range clarity the depth is very good in 1.3.1 compared to the earlier versions uh, the only difference i see between mod 4.2 and 1.3.1 is the color is actually more vivid in mod 4.2 compared to version 1.3.1 so some might actually prefer these vivid colors more than the flat colors of the official firmware version 1.3.1 but i actually prefer the more vivid colors uh, in mod 4.2 again you can see uh, these branches and leaves the difference is more uh, pronounced here also another important thing to note here is that uh, the recorded file size in version 1.3.1 is lesser than the mod 4.2 so do let me know what you prefer in the comment section below guys i would love to hear from you so this was shot between the sj7 and the sg8 mod 4.2 just to see how both these cams performed while i was riding my bike so again do let me know on what you thought about it in the comment section below So yeah that's it guys uh, I hope you enjoyed this vlog uh, and I hope it was informative for you guys uh, if you did like the vlog please do hit the like button and please don't forget to subscribe uh, also I'll provide the links of uh, how to upgrade the firmware from the official firmware to the unofficial mod 4.2 firmware in the description below and if you have any doubts please do ask in the comment section below I'll be glad to reply to it yeah thanks for watching until next time this time signing out bye bye